Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody posted this exact question on my Facebook page. They need a 2.413 circle along an arc exactly six millimeters apart from their centers. And they showed how they can do it with step and repeat, but how do you do it on an arc? Well, I don't know how many little circles she wants, and that would kind of depend on how long your arc is. So I've already done this to make sure it would work. I'm going to object break blend apart, select it all, object, ungroup, and I'm just gonna grab one of my circles and delete the rest of them. So here's my arch. How do I know how long that arch is? And this is depending on how far you want your arch to be. So you can go to Windows, Dockers, properties and click on right here and this thing is 1.38002 inches or millimeters long I had to change it to millimeters so here's my 2.413 i'm going to control d and make a duplicate and just move it over whoop control d move it over let's make sure we don't only have one i'm since i messed them up on the hit b that doesn't really matter go to effects and blend and we need 20 there's actually he had 23 but we need a starting and a stopping point on each end so i want to make 22 copies making 24 circles then i'm going to go click on that into new path and put it on that path go and blend along full path and hit apply now we can take our and because it's an arch this might not, they are, depending on what you want to call how far apart they are, if we turn this to millimeters, they are 5.99 millimeters. You take away one of the digits and it's six millimeters. So it's really, really close to being in that. Uh, if you have to be closer than that, then you have to do a little bit more on your arch. But is that truly that far apart because we're measuring in a straight line. If you need them on a curved line, I do not know, but one way to do it would be to draw a line, a two-point line from that center to that center, select it, right-click, and make it a curve, and then gently move it up to that curve, and let's just see how long this, and we're not exactly, but let's open up this docker again and we're 6.004 millimeters long. So I'm hoping that's close enough. Uh, I would surely think so. So it's depending on your arch, depending on how many, you didn't mention how many little circles you didn't, needed and you didn't know how long the arch, or, did, or we don't know how long the arch is. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.